Well, Lamp for Slaughter, of course, is the first that comes to mind. He did uh, Dip in the Pool with Keenan Wynn, a Raoul Dahl story about the guy who was a compulsive gambler and now is broke, and he, he was on a ship which paid off at whoever, whoever guessed the greatest distance it went and the shortest distance it went. And the guy decides he'll jump off the ship, which will cause it to stop and circle and reduce the mileage, and he would win the low bid. And he jumps, and the ship goes on. So Hitch directed that. He directed uh, Banquo's Chair, a famous ghost story. And uh, uh, he directed Poison, which was also another Raoul Dahl story. He directed the famous one called Breakdown, where Joe Cotton, in a car accident, can't move, can't talk. They think he's really dead until there's one tear comes down his cheek. And those are about four or five. He directed about ten. Well, Hitch was such a natural with film. I mean, it, it was very simple for him. There was one thing, though, uh, that was to be observed in regard to his directing television. <clears throat> he cautioned us all that it is a close medium. Just get your establishing shot and get in close as quickly as you can. And he adhered to that, so he never got involved in any complicated shots that involved a lot of staging. He just set it up, and then he got in close as fast as he could. And that's the way he did it. But you see, he had a great storytelling gift, so he could tell the story that way. Uh, his uh, desire was to make Psycho with the television team. And he did so with Jack Russell as the cameraman. And uh, the crew was basically the crew that we used on the television shows. And they were able to make it in a very short time, I think 28 or 30 days, I, thereabouts, and for $750,000. And uh, that's to be admired in this day.